Paul, thanks, thanks for joining us on I Follow Ipswich. What are your thoughts after that the hectic ending? Yeah, last time we, I think we deserved to win the game because we didn't lose the game. As I said before, we, we started the game really well. They got a goal, the penalty, which was a penalty, and they sat really deep, really, really defensive. And uh, which is their prerogative to, to play that way. And we've just got to be patient to break it down. A lot of good play, a lot of good ball, and we get we get adjusted towards. And um, some things I was happy with, some things I wasn't happy with. But all credit to the guys because we kept on going and kept on going. So really, really happy to win. Was that the message when you do go behind a goal? You just say, keep patient, lads. Your chances yeah. will come. Yeah, just keep doing what they're doing. Just just move it a little bit quicker than what they're doing. So um, it's very hard when the team plays. You know, everybody behind the ball, and then they try and hit you in the counter. So, um, but we played some good stuff, as I said, and um, yeah, with a lot of little knocks. So, yeah, it's another another good three points. Substitutions as well. We've just seen that the, the five substitutions are all come in, and and uh, we've taken the benefits from it today. With Bennett's coming on and changing the game, Norwood as well, and others. The subs did make a make a make a contribution. Jack obviously came on early early on. Keenan thought done well. Nors looked looked to his old self. <clears throat> which is great, so um, I'm really happy with we, we the win. Could, could we play better? Yeah, could we be more, more clinical? But again, I'll credit to the guys because they come up against a team that had like a five and then a four and a one at times and it's tough to break it down and they'll go give them something to hang on to. And you've got to be patient and break it down. I'll credit to them because we kept on prodding, prodding, prodding and got the just award. What did you think of um, Mark McGuinness? Because a difficult start to the game for him, but then he put in plenty of... Um, aerial duels, plenty of challenges, and well, yeah, played well for the rest of the game. He did, and um, he's had a hard week. I mean, he's had a really hard week. Obviously, James Wilson's been injured, but Mark has had really played violent two days uh, Yeah, Thursday, played the violent. <clears throat> this came back yesterday training. He's only 19, it's his first loan, and he's been, he's been excellent for us over the piece. He's been great, so I'm really happy with him. We'll feature just back from the isolation thing, and uh, yeah, we've got another couple of injuries, I guess. You just said there are ways that you, that you want to play better in, in certain aspects. What are they for, for Harlan Charlton? Because two difficult games ag again coming up. Two tough games, but you, maybe they'll come out and give us give us more open game. Yeah, we and hopefully we 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 can exploit that. But I'm really happy how we play football. This football is really good. We dominate a lot of the ball, and and the way we're playing it, and we're going to get games like that. No credit to the guys again. They, they produced when when if you have to win titles. You're going to get games like that, you grind it out. So, um, yeah, I'm happy. Great moment for Jack, obviously. A great moment for the team, but great moment for him personally as well. Well, he really scored in the last game against Sunderland as well, and we should have had another one up there. He's, he's still, he's, listen, he's still, for me, in my opinion, is, is, is short of match stuff, without a doubt. And he's just back from the two bad injuries, or two bad back injuries. So, um, happy for him. He's still got a lot of work to go, but we have, we have a young team as well there as well. So, there's a lot of good stuff. Finally, obviously we've lost Nolo today, Bish as well. It's very early stages, but any, any thoughts on their injuries? I don't know, Jacob, because uh, I, I don't know. It doesn't look too, too promising, so but we have to wait and see.